One British traveler set a new world record by visiting all seven wonders of the world in less than seven days. CBS 2's Tina Krause has more on this whirlwind adventure. Mm -hmm. I have got to hit the roads. And I'm when Jamie McDonald said I'm goodbye to his family in England. And I'm going to bring you something back really special. He knew he'd be gone for less than a week. This challenge for me made me the most nervous because there was 43 pieces of transportation that needed to go right. His mission? To see the seven wonders of the world in less than seven days. Come on, we're doing it. Starting with the Great Wall of China. I actually feel quite emotional. Then the breathtaking Taj Mahal in India. I don't think I've ever seen anything as beautiful as that as a building goes. Oh, wow. And the ancient city of Petra in Jordan. Three out of seven wonders. But there was little time to revel in the moment. McDonald had another plane to catch. 18F again. He took 13 flights in all, 16 taxis, nine buses, four trains. Here we go. <laughs> and a toboggan as he ticked off a bucket list of world landmarks. Can you actually believe people used to like fight to the death down there? It just blows my mind. With every wow. wonder he witnessed, the globetrotter known as Adventure Man raised money for his superhero foundation helping kids with disabilities. We've done it, Jamie. We've done it. And on the oh, final yeah. lap the at Chichen Itza in Mexico, <laughs> he set a world record just in time to fly home for more adventure. <laughs> Tina Krause, CBS News, London. Okay, we have our own places, dream places Ooh. we would like to visit. Yes. I've been to Italy a couple of times, but I've never been to Venice. Oh, like to yes. go to Venice, oh, right? Beautiful. There you go. The canals, the gondolas. Gorgeous. I've Somebody been there, singing actually. in the back. And you know, I was told before we went that you could either go or not. If you don't, if you, if it's a problem, don't go. I'm yes. so glad we did. But yeah. we went in the wintertime, so it wasn't real crowded. Uh, yeah. it, it was fabulous. All right. Gorgeous. So my dream location on my bucket list is Cuba. It's where my father was born. Yes. Mm -hmm. I want to go find the house. We believe it's still standing uh, where he lived for a time in his childhood. And oh, I'd like look to at that shout car. out. Yeah, these are pictures from our producer Rebecca's trip there, which uh, she had, said she had a lovely time. Uh, so I. I hope to go someday soon. Yeah, mm, I can't wait to, to see go there that. Too. Yeah. All right, so mine is the Maldives. Ooh. Ooh. So I want to be right on the water. You know those yes. bungalows where you oh. walk it and you. And or just slip right over the that edge into the great. pool and do nothing but look at the look beauty. At of <laughs> I, I don't think I put my response in in time. So okay, what but, is but that, it was similar. I was going to say just somewhere warm and exotic, like yeah. maybe Turks and Caicos or something yeah. like that. Or that's yeah. beautiful. I'm with yeah. you on that. Or, you know, I, yeah. the eighth wonder of the world, which is the grotto, the Jim Williams house. Oh, right? oh that's, yeah. That's, you know what? I heard about that. Yeah. Okay. Are we invited? That'd be a bit. A big disappointment. <laughs> 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 All right, guys. Thanks All right. a lot. Thank Great. You.